Since the start of the ceasefire in Lebanon, Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu said on Thursday said that if Hezbollah were to violate the agreement, there would be intensive war. Take a look at the special report. Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu said that if Hezbollah were to violate the agreement of a ceasefire, there would be an intensive war. He said he has given the Israeli Defense Forces instructions to follow in the case of a massive violation of the agreement. Meanwhile, a day after the ceasefire took effect, the IDF's home front commander lifted all restrictions on gatherings south of Haifa. The restrictions which limited the number of people allowed at indoor and outdoor gatherings were put in place amid heavy rocket firing from Hezbollah. On Thursday, military carried out a number of strikes in Lebanon for the first time since the ceasefire began. The IDF said that it has targeted terror operatives and violations of the troops. The Israeli army also said that it has fired warning shots of several suspects entering restricted areas. Welcome back to yours. You're watching Life This Morning, where we bring you stories to set the tone for your day. Now, the YSRCP top leader and former Chief Minister YS Jagan Mohan Reddy on Thursday has strongly refuted allegations of payment of bribes to Andhra Pradesh officials by the Adani Group for the solar power purchases during his party-led government and said his name was not mentioned anywhere in a U.S. court's indictment on the matter. Watch a special report with all the details. Refuting all allegations of bribery is wild. Former Andhra Pradesh Chief Minister Y.S. Jagan Mohan Reddy broke his silence on his name being linked to Adani indictment case. It's a huge waiver. It's a huge incentive offered as a special incentive to the state. And one should appreciate that for having concluded such a I mean, such a historic uh, PPA, such a historic pub, power sale agreement. He further said that the allegations of bribe are mere hearsay. Somebody should be mad to do something like this. I've displayed all the PPAs. I've displayed all the rates. What have been, what the state government is currently procuring power at. 